the White House after making his visit to Europe with a powerful speech in Poland. Nothing to see here, just standing in front of a building with a wrinkly wall and a wrinkly window. As for whether it was a... Bruh. Now, I know a lot of people probably didn't catch that. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull up just a clip. We're going to show just a picture. Bruh. Do you see this? That's a fake window. That's a fake building. Do you see this? Listen to me, man. <laughs> at this point, at this point, it's just like, who's believing in this man? Are those fake people? No, no, no. No, no. <laughs> With all the technology in the world, they could at least just did some green screens. Like, this is, this is just too in your face. I don't even understand the purpose with this. Why would they, why would they do this in front of a fake building? Is this on purpose? Like, it gotta, it gotta be. I'm telling y'all, man, some of the stuff I get sent is wild. And that was definitely Sleepy Joe in front of the building. If you didn't catch it, let's watch it again. Heading home to the White House after making his visit to Europe with a powerful speech in public. Nothing to see here, just standing in front of a building with a wrinkly wall and a wrinkly window. As for whether it was a mistake in a... Now, did you catch it that time? Guys, fake window, fake walls, fake building, fake promises. Everything these people told us was fake. Fake promises. Just fake individuals whose love for the people is fake. Just a whole bunch of leaders trying to pull in wicked agendas. Just a whole bunch of leaders trying to take God out of the equation. Just a whole bunch of leaders leading the land of the free to destruction. How many people are still blind and can't see what's actually going on? That's the scary part. The fact that there still is people out there who can't really see what's going on. Guys, I pray more and more people wake up. I pray more you guys shine light into the darkness that is going on in the world right now because that's exactly what needs to happen. Light needs to be shined because a lot of these people don't even know what light is anymore. Stay on the narrow path with the Lord. Allow the Lord to lead your footsteps. Let's continue to wake people up more and more, you guys. United we stand divided, we fall. I love you guys. God bless. Shalom.